Today, I am going to show you how to make these three macrame snowflakes. For this first snowflake, what you're going to need is 13 strands of 3 millimeter macrame cord cut to 55 centimeters or 22 inches, a pair of scissors, and a comb or a wire dog brush. To start the snowflake, we're going to take one cord and lay it across our working space. And then we're going to take our other 12 cords and attach them to the center of this working cord using lark's head knots and pulling each knot super tight. Now that we have all 12 cords attached, we're going to turn this sideways. We'll call this our top cord, this our bottom cord. We're going to bring the top cord over the bottom cord, take the bottom cord and wrap it around the top cord and pull it really tight so it looks like this. Then we're going to pinch there, take the bottom cord, bring it under the top cord and wrap it around again. And we're going to work this down so that we can tighten this knot. So it should look like this. And pull it really tight and then pull the top cord. Now we're going to take the two cords that we just used and tie a knot like this. Pull that tight and we'll trim that later. Now we should have six groups of four cords and we're going to go around and do a square knot on each one. Now that we have our square knots done, we're going to continue working with the same set of four cords. We're going to take the leftmost cord and make a double half hitch knot going down and right. And then we're going to take the rightmost cord and make two double half hitch knots going down and left. We're going to make another double half hitch knot going down and left. And then we're going to take this cord and make one double half hitch knot going down and right. So it should look like an X. And now we're going to start on the next four cords. And then we're going to repeat that on all four remaining sets. Once we finish our X's, we're going to take two cords from one X and two cords from the X next to it and make a square knot in between them. And we're going to repeat that all the way around. Pulling the bottom knot super tight. When we come to this set of two cords that we've tied off earlier, we're just going to make our square knot in front of it. Now that we have all our knots tied, we're going to go through and trim the ends just a little bit. Now we're going to go through and brush out our ends. Now that we have our ends brushed out, we're just going to go through and do another little trim. And there you have it, the first macrame snowflake. For the second snowflake, what you're going to need is 13 strands of 3 millimeter macrame cord cut to 55 centimeters or 22 inches, a pair of scissors, and a comb or a wire dog brush. To start the second snowflake, you're going to take one cord and lay it across your workspace, and then you're going to attach the other 12 cords to the center of that cord using lark's head knots. Make sure to pull your knots super tight and scoot your cords together. Once you have all 12 cords attached, turn your work sideways. This will be our top cord, this will be our bottom cord. Bring the top cord over the bottom cord, 
take the bottom cord and wrap it around the top cord, pull it through, hold the top cord and pull the bottom cord really tight, pinch right there, take the bottom cord, bring it behind the top cord, around and through, and work it down until you can tighten it. And then pull it really tight. Pull the top cord, tighten the bottom cord, and it should look like this. Now that you have your ring, take the two cords you were just working with, loop them around, pull them through to knot them, and then just trim that off. You should have six sets of four, and on each set we're going to make two square knots. Now that we've done our square knots, we're going to take two cords from each set of four and make a square knot in between them. And after our first square knot, we're going to make a second square knot slightly down the holding cords. So we'll make it right here. And then we're going to slide it up so that it has these little wings coming off. When you get to these two cords that we knotted and cut earlier, we're just going to make our square knot in front of them. Now that we have our square knots done, we're going to go around and trim the cords. And then we are going to start combing out our ends. Once we have our ends brushed out, we're going to go through and do one more trim. And there is our second macrame snowflake. What you're going to need for this third snowflake is 13 strands of 3 millimeter macrame cord cut to 70 centimeters or 28 inches and a pair of scissors. To start this third snowflake, you're going to take one cord and lay it across your workspace and then you're going to attach the other 12 cords to the center of that cord using lark's head knots. Make sure to pull your lark's head knots really tight and slide them together so there's no space in between them. Once you have all 12 cords attached, turn your work sideways this will be our top cord and this will be our bottom cord. Take the top cord and bring it over the bottom cord. Take the bottom cord and wrap it around the top cord and pull it through. Hold the top cord and pull the bottom cord really tight to close this circle. Pinch where they meet. Take the bottom cord and bring it under the top cord and back around the top cord. and then work it down until you can tighten them. And then pull the bottom cord really tight. And it should look like this. Take the top cord and bottom cord, loop them, and pull the cords through the loop to tie a knot, and then trim off the ends. Working with one group of four, take the leftmost cord and make a double half hitch knot going down and right. Now take the right cord and make two double half hitch knots going down and left. Now you should have a little V. Using your new left cord, do one double half hitch knot going down and right. Using your new right cord, do two double half hitch knots going down and left.
Now repeat that on all the other sets of four. Once we have our six points done, we're going to take two strands and work this way, making two double half hitch knots along this cord. One, two. Then we're going to take these two cords using this one as our holding cord and do two double half hitch knots going this way. One, two. So now we have these four cords together. We're going to take this holding cord again and make a double half hitch knot using this other holding cord. So now these two are connected to make a V. Then we're going to take this left cord, bring it this way and make one double half hitch knot. Now we're going to take our right cord bring it this way and make two double half hitch knots. And now we have another V. We're going to go around and do the same thing. When you get to the cords that are to the side of the two strands that you cut and knotted earlier, you're going to do two and a half double half hitch knots. One, two, and a half. So you're going to have five half hitch knots right here and you're going to do the same on this side two and a half double half hitch knots or five half hitch knots once you're done with all six points you're just going to go through and trim the cords and there you have it your third macrame snowflake if you like this tutorial i would appreciate you giving it a like comment down below with which snowflake was your favorite and be sure to subscribe for more craft tutorials.